Miss Chen, I hope this call finds you well. I couldn't help but notice your recent substantial investment in green energy bonds. It's always exciting to see your strategic moves. Ah, yes. Good morning. Those bonds seemed like a solid opportunity given the current market trends. Indeed. Your instincts have served you well in the past. I'll be happy to send you some recent research notes from our bank and Moody's on these bonds, especially with current market volatility. Was there anything else I could help you with today? Actually, yes. I've come into some additional funds recently and I'm looking to reinvest. What do you have in mind for me? Okay, given your recent history of successful tech investments, I do have a suggestion that might align with your interests. Have you considered increasing your position in the Invesco QQQ Trust? It's an ETF that tracks the NASDAQ 100 index and has a strong focus on tech giants. QQQ, you say? Hmm, that does sound interesting. What's been its performance lately? While past performance doesn't guarantee future results, QQQ has shown robust growth over the years. It's known for its exposure to companies like Apple, Microsoft, Amazon, and other giant tech leaders. Over the past decade, it's consistently outperformed many other broad market ETFs. I like the sound of that. What would you recommend in terms of investment size? Well, for a client of your caliber, Ms. Chen, I would suggest considering an investment in the range of 200 to 220,000 US dollars. This would allow you to significantly increase your tech exposure without over concentrating your portfolio. Would you like me to prepare a more detailed analysis? Yes, let's do that. And let's start with $200,000. I think it's a good time to boost my tech holdings. Excellent choice, Ms. Chen. I'll prepare that analysis right away and initiate the investment process. Is there anything else I can assist you with today? No, that'll be all. Oh, and do keep an eye out for any promising biotech opportunities. I might be interested in exploring that sector in the near future. Okay, I'll certainly keep you informed of any notable biotech opportunities that come across my desk. Ms. Chen. If I remember right, Sophia may be applying to colleges these days. Is that true? Indeed she is. She was actually accepted to both Oxford and Cambridge to study law. That's great, Miss Chen. Congratulations. So I guess she'll be moving to the UK soon. From banking perceptives, we can have her covered very quickly. Uh, we can open an account for her at our UK bank and she'll receive the right treatment. We have special benefits for student accounts as well. Shall I start with that process? Oh, wow, please do. We have so much to manage with her move to the UK. At least we won't need to worry about this. Excellent. So I'll be sending you two emails then. One with the research notes we discussed before uh, about the QQQ investment process, and then a follow-up email with the opening of Sophia's UK bank account. Thank you for your uh, continued trust in our services.